This new AI update from NA10 is absolutely insane and it's made building AI agents 10 times easier. This update that's just come out is absolutely insane. It makes it 10 times easier to code and honestly building AI agents and workflows. If you've been sitting on the fence, you're like, I need to start automating stuff, but I'm not sure where to start, etc. Good job you waited because it's easier than ever before. Let me show you exactly what I mean. Basically inside our AI agents, what you can see here is normally you would have to feed in the this information that explains exactly what you're going to be automating, right? So it would say, for example, you're the brackets here, then you have to say, okay, here's the input from the previous module that we're going to use for this module. And basically the AI agent is using the information from the workflow. But the thing about this is super time consuming and quite difficult to set up and quite like picky. And it's one of the reasons I actually don't use automation tools like Make and Zapier anymore, simply because it's really fiddly to set up the expressions and the relevant steps inside here and you have to do it step by step, etc. Now what you can do is you can actually feed them in automatically using the AI and I'll show you exactly how to do that today. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over to manage our workspace. So if you're on the na10.cloud dashboard, you wanna click on manage at the top. And then from here, we're gonna select our version that we want to update, which is going to be 1.80.3. It is beta, so it's not the most stable, but I've not had any problems. With and we're gonna click on that, and then we're gonna hit save changes. Then we'll confirm that's gonna restart the workspace. It might take one to two minutes to update there, but it's very easy to do. And that will give you the latest update from NA10, which is absolutely awesome for building no-code NA10 agents and a lot faster. I'll actually show you how fast and easy it is to do. So that just took a couple of minutes to update. Then we're gonna click on open the workspace. We'll create a new workflow, just to show you how easy this is. We're gonna add a new step. And also this is good if you're not used to building agents yet, or you're not sure where to start, etc. Then basically you're gonna add a new chat trigger and that's gonna trigger basically your workflow and your automations inside the chat section right there. I'll show you exactly how it works in a minute and how easy this is. Now, then we're gonna add an AI agent, like you can see. Underneath that, we're gonna select open router and we'll just go with like the basics just to keep it simple and easy today. When you're doing this as well, you just make sure you add your credentials for each part. So for example, for open router, you can add your credentials right there. Check out my other videos on that or the AI Profit Boardroom if you need some help. This is where it gets interesting. So if we type in a tool, so for example, let's use Gmail to send stuff. What you can see is that previously you had fixed an expression, but you didn't let the model define this parameter. That is the main point of this, right? So if we click on that and then we click on that, all right? And now we can send emails automatically using this process right here. It's so much more powerful and interesting because now you can automatically figure out, okay, the AI is going to figure out who to send things to, what the subject of the email is going to be, and what the message should be as well, based on the inputs we give the chat, right? So if we've got, for example, this AI agent that triggers when we've got the chat, we've got Gmail set up, boom, shakalaka, ready to go. We're going to click on open chat and let's say, send an email to me at juliangoldie.com and tell him the latest NA10 update is absolutely insane. And uh, make sure it's in capital letters, all right? Because if you don't capitalize the word then insane, then, then what are you doing here? We're gonna hit enter, that's gonna trigger the agent, boom shakalaka, now I've got the agent, and we just created that automation, and it worked beautifully first time round. We didn't have to mess around with it, that saved me so much time and headaches. And it was actually one of the things that used to put me off, creating more agents with NA10. So if we go on the emails now and we go to send, look at that, that just worked perfectly. Latest NA10 update to me at juliangoldie.com, and bear in mind, like we didn't choose any of these parameters, right? So it figured it all out. The AI figures it all out based on the chat that we give it. So we're just like, here's a message, right? This is a message. And then the AI is like, right, okay, I'm gonna figure out who that needs to be sent to, what the subject should be, and what the message should be. And we can just build out no code NA10 agents way faster than we ever could do before. And so it actually figured out what the message is gonna be, right? We didn't have to sell it, it just wrote it. It figured out, okay, Here's what the subject should be, right? And it capitalized it because why not go full caps locks? And you can see here it says the email was automatically sent with NA10. And then finally for the two section as well, it's just blasted off to me at juliangoldie.com. And we've just got a customized agent that is super powerful, right? Really powerful and easy to set up. So no building and building agents with AIs is only gonna get easier. I think this is a step towards huge progress and who knows what it's gonna be able to do in the future. It's just wild stuff. It is wild. So
Let's try something else now. What we're gonna do is we're gonna grab this calendar tool over here and we're gonna let the AI define all of this stuff. We don't wanna be messing around with it, all right? It's automatically gonna figure out what's the relevant calendar, the start date, the end date, the default parameters, and we'll just leave everything to the AI, all right? Then I'm gonna go inside the chat and I'll say, create a calendar event for a NA10 AI agent party on re 23rd, 2025 in me at juliangoldie.com's calendar, plus send a heads up to me at juliangoldie.com. Right. And it'll be for one hour. So we're rocking and we're rolling right now. It's using the tools as you can see. We didn't have to fill in any parameters, didn't have to mess around with that nonsense. And it's created the calendar, as you can see, you can actually view the event. We've got the email right here as well, so it says, heads up, NA10 AI agent party. Hey, just a heads up, there's gonna be an NA10 agent party scheduled for February 25th at 7 p.m. UTC. Look forward to seeing you there, because who doesn't email themselves about NA10 AI agent parties on a Sunday? And then you can see it's created the invite right there. That was incredibly simple and easy, and you can quickly see how you could build your own sort of AI assistant or a tool without any coding experience. Now, to put this in perspective, if you were using, say, an AI automation tool like make.com, for automating. Can you imagine like how much work you'd have to put in when you're mapping out something complex? So this is even a basic one, but you're gonna have to click individually into this and then set up all the parameters. Then inside the AI agent bot, quite often this doesn't work. If you're setting it up all manually, cause you have to choose a chat ID and then the text and then the message thread and then everything else. And it can easily break, right? All of this stuff can easily break. Whereas you go inside NA10, you're like, I don't wanna mess around with the to section or the subject or the message. We're just gonna do it inside the chat right here. And the AI is intelligent enough to figure it all out. So let's start off from scratch and we'll start the timer and I'll show you how easy it is to build your own tool. So let's say, for example, last year you had all these blogging tools that were taking absolutely, that cost hundreds of dollars per month and they were pretty time consuming and they never really gave the output that people wanted, right? Like in terms of personalization, in terms of like getting the outputs that you want, everything else. Whereas inside AI NA10, using these AI agents, you can easily build something and you can create whatever you want in literally a few minutes, right? So for example, we're gonna use AI to fill this in, etc. boom shakalaka. And then what we're gonna do from here, we're gonna inside the NA10 agent, then we'll add an option, system message. We'll say create an SEO optimized for this, SEO train in Japan. We're good to go on that. That has taken us 51 seconds to build, right? So 51 seconds, we'll build out this AI agent that can create SEO content just inside the chat here. So I'm gonna say, okay, create the blog post and email it to me at juliangoldie.com. Again, this took 51 seconds to build. Let's test it out now. So I'm gonna say inside the chat here, create the blog post and email it to me at juliangoldie.com, HTML format. Let's see what we got here. And it's creating the content, starting to write that. We've got the, and you can see the log here, right? So you can see it goes from AI agent, open router to Gmail. We've got the content inside Gmail. So it figured out who to send it to, what to write, etc. If you go over to Gmail now, we've got the article ready to go. It's user custom instructions we gave it. It's got personalized funnel links to whatever we want. And we have the blog post ready to post, right? For example, let's go to write article plug that in inside LinkedIn, for example, and it was so easy to write the content. But not only that, but all of this content right here is all personalized to us, right? So it's got the keyword front loaded in the title, nice little introduction right there. This isn't like spammy content and we built it in 51 seconds. Plus it's more personalized to us. It didn't take any time at all. And now every time I come back to the workflow, I can say create an article on whatever keyword I want, send it out to Gmail, email it to myself and they get it posted, right? Really simple stuff. So thanks so much for watching. What I'm actually gonna do is I will save that and then I will download the JSON file from this particular video along with the JSON file from the previous workflow, the calendar and Gmail agent will download that. And if you wanna steal that from me, you can get it inside the AI Profit Boardroom, link in the comments description. If we go down to the classroom, then we go to SPs and we'll add a new page called 51 second no code AI agents with NA10. Then I'm gonna attach the resource files that we talked about. And if you want both of these files, the email plus calendar assistant is set up and ready to go for you to import right there. Let's just add the other file, which was the AI SEO content writer tool. 
We've plugged those in and you can get those for free. And you can get those templates ready to go inside the AI Profit Boardroom, along with all my best workflows, AI agents, etc. building AI agents with DeepSeek. If you actually like NA10 stuff, you're gonna love this. So if we type in NA10 here, you can see that we have tons of different lessons on like sales agents, scraping live web pages, DeepSeek agents, so many different workflows. Not only that, but you also get a community of one members that are all interested in growing their business with AI and saving hundreds of hours. On top of that, you get all of these courses and classrooms and videos with our Q&A recordings. And if you wanna jump on weekly calls directly with me, then you can jump on the, the weekly Q&As as you can see inside the calendar. And we're constantly updating this as well. For example, this was the third update from this week, all right? And we've already added all of these updates, plus every Tuesday and Thursday, me and Vic sit down and we just build new stuff for you based on the community feedback. So make sure you join that link in the comments description. And if you want to get a free one-to-one -one SEO strategy session, feel free to build that and we'll show you how we take websites from zero to 145,000 bits this month and generate hundreds of thousands of dollars in sales on Spilot. On this free link building acceleration session, you'll get a free SEO domination plan. So you'll get a custom tailored link building plan so you can generate more lead sales and profits from your website. You'll discover the secrets of SEO link building. Answer any questions you have one-to-one. -one. You'll learn the best link building strategy for your website plus how to outrank your competitors in LinkedIn and how to turn SEO traffic based on what's working for us and our happy clients like you can see right here. Feel free to get that link in the comments and description. Appreciate you watching. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.